Arty Farty Marty, The Paint Smash and Kraken by Dale Barker. Arty Farty Marty loves to paint and surf. He's got a mad studio two hours from Perth. He rides tubes every morning and smashes out paintings during the day. While other dudes are working, he's madly painting away. He's only a kid-sized kraken, but that's not small at all. When stretching out his tentacles, Marty is 10 meters tall. A kraken is a legendary sea monster, thought to be like a giant octopus. Marty blasts out music from his old radio speakers and cruises about in his arty farty sneakers. When it's time for a break, he busts out his painted up guitar and flings it about like an old school rock star. Marty can paint like artists of the most famous kind. He adds his own style with more fun than you'll ever find. On Monday, Marty created his own Da Vinci style painting together with a flamed up hot rod and Mona Lisa skating. The Mona Lisa is one of the most famous paintings in the world, created by Leonardo da Vinci. Da Vinci was also an architect, engineer, mathematician, scientist, sculptor and inventor. Whew. On Tuesday, Marty painted in the style of Van Gogh's Starry Night. For fun, he painted himself and other sea creatures giving little fish a fright. Vincent Van Gogh was very poor and sold very few paintings in his lifetime. In 1990, 100 years after he died, Van Gogh's painting Portrait of Dr. Gachette sold for 82.5 million US dollars. Whoa! Wednesday was a Salvador Dali type of day, so Marty painted melting clocks and made a telephone cray. Salvador Dali came up with the idea of melting clocks when he noticed camembert cheese melting one day. Dali also designed the famous Chubba Chups lollipop logo. Nom nom nom. On Thursday it was all about Andy Warhol to the max. But instead of soup cans, Marty painted his favourite surf wax. Andy Warhol was famous for pop art in which he used very bright colours and images, like soup cans repeated over and over and over. On Friday, Picasso's style was on his mind, so Marty painted beach goers of the cubist kind. In 1911, Pablo Picasso was wrongly accused of stealing the Mona Lisa from the Louvre in Paris. Police suspected that Picasso stole the Mona Lisa simply because he was a modern artist. Weird, huh? On Saturday, Marty painted the calm, impressionist style of Claude Monet. Marty's water lilies had faces all laughing and at play. When he was a kid, Claude Monet doodled caricatures of his teachers in his school books. He sold some of these funny drawings to his classmates. Cool as! On Saturday night, Marty wasn't sure which technique to trial, so he did a few paintings in completely different styles. Paintings in the style of Jackson Pollock, Sidney Nolan and Reg Mombasa were his top pick. The Pollock one was the most fun, made by making the paint smash, splat and drip. Sidney Nolan was best known for his paintings of the bushranger Ned Kelly. Reg Mombasa helped create the look for surf brand Mambo. Jackson Pollock was famous for his drip paintings. Sunday had the great Michelangelo type of feeling. Marty finished off the week with a surfing mural on his ceiling. The Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles were named after the Italian artists Michelangelo, Leonardo da Vinci, Raphael and Donatello. That Sunday night, Marty was up very late and accidentally sat on his paint. And as he was painting so fast, he suddenly did a backdoor blast. 
the paint had hit Marty's drawing figurine and created the most vibrant painting he'd ever seen. He didn't realise it right at the start, but Marty had created a piece of art. So if you see Marty at your local fish and chip shop, be sure to say g'day. He'd be more than stoked to stop. Confidence is something that Marty doesn't lack. He'll encourage you to surf and paint. Go on, have a crack. When you start to look around, you'll see art everywhere from pictures on shop windows to t-shirts people wear. Look around the room you're in, see what you can find. All this art and design came from a creative mind. Wondering if you should give art a go or wait another day? Well, this is what Arty Farty Marty has to say. Get cracking. To be or not to be. The end.